Hello and welcome to the show. Well, this week I've had trouble with my zapping machine. I went for Bruce Forsyth and ended up with Tom Cruise's head on Beyonce's body. Whoa! Oh, that's a sight not to be in. But anyway, enough of my troubles. Hey ho, tickety boo. Talk of Tom is here for you. My zap machine is acting like a coup. So who will it be? I haven't a clue! Whoa! Eh? Hey? Look who it is, it's me! It is! Hello! Hello, me! Hello, you! How are you? <laughs> I'm not you! I'm me! Oh, you me! Oh, me? Me! Oh, the zap machine has lost! Oh. <laughs> We've lost the zap machine. Oh no, what's that do? Oh, I don't know. Why don't we just do a show? Oh, good, yeah, let's do, yeah. Let's do, do a show. Yeah, and I'll interview me. Yes. And you can answer me. Wait a minute, are you <laughs> the talking of Tom? Of course I'm the talking of Tom. Oh. Oh, there you go, viewers. How do we know who's the real talking of Tom? I've got an idea. I'm going to ask some questions and we'll see by the answers if this is a real... Talk it up, Tom. How about that, folks? You up for it? Hit it! <laughs> I'm not allowed to. <laughs> we, could, we could take off the air if we started doing violence. It's bad enough the zap machine going all over the place. We don't want violence. No, 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 no. Anyway, right, here's some questions for you. Go ahead. Question one. What made you choose this as a career, being a talk show host? Well, my friend John, John wants me to do uh, my own show. Well, he wanted you to do your own show? Yeah, he does. Did you not want to do your own show? I, I always wanted to do a show, yeah. Ah, right, so did he just sort of help you realise your ambition? Oh, yes, he always helped me. Ah, oh, right. <laughs> I'd pay him some more money. <laughs> Try and keep him on board. Yeah, can't get help though. Aye. Aye. So you get yourself comfy there? Oh, they very comfy. Yeah, you think it was your house. <laughs> it is my house. <laughs> anyway, right, question two. Which TV host has been your biggest inspiration? Uh, that would be Jonathan Walsh and Graham Norton. Oh, Graham Norton? Yes. Ah, I liked him when he was in Father Ted. Oh, yes, he was yeah. a great man in Father Ted. Aye, and then he was in the Channel 4 show as well, wasn't he? Yeah, he is. Aye. Yes, he is. Yeah, he was quite good then, I seem uh, to remember. Yeah, he was a very good man, good man. I remember watching it with you. No. <laughs> well, well, I must have done because I'm you. I know you are. Yeah, well, if you watched it, I must have watched it. Oh, yes. Does that make any sense? No. No. <laughs> Do we care? No. No, no, no. Anyway, right, question three. So, so far you've, we've interviewed lots and lots and lots of celebrities. Oh, yes. Okay. Now, being the real talker of Tom, oh, yes. I, know, I know who my favourite celebrity has been to interview. Mm. Right? So, who was yours? Mine is Nigel Plaskett. Nigel Plaskett? Nigel Plaskett. Why? Because he is a puppeteer of his books well be. Right. So why him in particular? Just because of that is what he does at Spooks? Well, he does the voice of the characters on that show. All oh, right. So is that what you like about him? Yes. Oh, good. So was that a good interview? Oh, it was a perfect interview. How many views have you had? Oh, I had a, quite a dozen. <laughs> OK. Right, we'll need more views. Nigel Plaskett, apparently it's a cracker. Oh, yes. Aye. Actually, moving on. Moving on. Eh... Uh, if you had the chance, mm -hmm. what celebrity would you choose to spend a day with? Oh, that would be with Jack Black. Jack Black? Jack Black. He's oh. my favourite actor of the whole wide world. Right. So what is it about him that makes you his favourite, makes him your favourite? Well, usually he's done a great movie in his time, like the Munchies, the Rock. Ah. So you like his movies? I love his movies. Yeah. Except one. Oh. I know what one that is. Yes. Yeah. I don't really talk about it. Yeah. What about the viewers, though? Uh, but the viewers like it, but I don't. Mm, but they don't know what one you're talking about. No. Well, I tell them. Go ahead. 
No, I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wrap myself out. Come on, I mean, you know, that could cause me problems later on. I know. <laughs> anyway, anyway, let's go <laughs> back to the past. What was your favourite childhood memory? Oh, my favourite childhood memory is... Rosie and Jim. Rosie and Jim? Rosie and Jim. Oh, my favourite ones. No, have you not got a, like one for you did something? Oh, yes. When you were a child. Aye, that's what we want to get. We want to get to the, the nitty gritty of what makes... Ah, uh, yes. Tom Webster tick. Yeah, we, we know the TV shows and that, but we want to know a wee bit more about you. Ah, so, uh, well... What was your favourite childhood well, memory? My favourite childhood memory is my own pets. Oh, yeah. So what did you have? I had two rabbits. Oh, they were lovely. I remember them. Yeah, Peter and Stella. Yeah. And then um, I look, I look, I was in very much with the help of my mum. Yeah. Mum, and but my mum's friend got one as well. Yeah. Well, my mum's friend was to call it vodka. <laughs> vodka. We won't ask why. We'll no, not ask why. No. 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 But we named it Shadow. Shadow. Yes. Ah. And then I had a a dog. Dog. Right. I was four years old. Yeah. He was old and wet and died. Oh. When I was four years old. Oh, that's a shame. And when I was seven, I went, seven, I went to my mum's sister. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, sister. I went horse riding. Oh, right. We were great horses like Rory, Kipping, Pepper, Bubbles. Hmm. Well, it seems like your favourite memories has got to do with all the pets and stuff and animals that have been in your life. Yes. Yeah, that's a good memory. I like that. Yeah. Yeah, pets and that cool. Yeah. Right. Right, I've got another question for you. Go ahead. Um, so... What do you want to achieve with your YouTube channel? Well, I want to be more famous than anybody else. What, more famous than the Beatles? More famous than the Beatles. Well, you better start getting subscribing and watching this, folks. He wants to be, we want to be bigger than the Beatles. Yes, more bigger than the Beatles, man. Yes. <laughs> you can help me with a song here. You sure, ready? Sure, what song? Right. Help. You know, we need some viewers. Help. 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 We need some subscribers right here, right now. We need some subscribers right here, right now. You can buy me from Penny Lane <laughs> and the Yellow Submarine. Anyway, it's been weird talking to myself. Yes. Yeah, but here I take you Talk of Tom disappear the new. Hey. <laughs> and all that was left was a hat. Anyway, hopefully next time we'll have the zap machine working and we'll have another celebrity guest on the Talkit of Tom show. Hey ho, tickety boo. Talkit of Tom saying, we'll see you soon.